Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I want to talk about um, making the decision to come off antidepressants. Um, basically, I've been on antidepressants, I think, for I don't know how many years, maybe 10 years maybe. Um, and while initially I think they did serve a big purpose and they did help me a lot um, I just remember two months ago I think or three months ago just sort of reevaluating them in terms of how effective they were um, I mean, they bring you to a stable level, but for me, the, once they reach that level, you just kind of stay at the same level, shredding water, kind of. Um, and I just, it just made me wonder. Uh, if I need them anymore, um, or if, if, um, if I've gained everything I can out of them, and maybe it's time to cut down, uh, <coughs> cut down on my dosage, with the aim to ultimately um, stop taking them, because I mean. I don't think they're doing anything more for me um, so at this point I feel like they're kind of being dependent on them uh, it kind of restricts me because I have to always worry about having access to the medication and that could limit me if, if I wanted to go travelling or if I wanted to move abroad um, financially uh, it's a big concern um, for me whether or not I'd be able to afford them. Uh, it's such an essential thing that I'm dependent on. So I think instead of being helpful, I s sort of felt like they were being a financial kind of financial drain on me that I. If I want to grow as a person and develop, I need to sort of cut ties with them and move on. Um, so I think I've used them as a crutch for years now and I think it's time to, I don't think I need the crutch anymore. Um, I think I'm equipped with the knowledge and understanding of mental health and depression um, to be able to go it alone um, and yeah just to be able to say I want to move abroad um, that's quite financially taxing on a person because um, you've got to move your whole life over there you've got to you don't know if you're gonna find a job straight away, you've gotta pay accommodation, you've gotta eat, you've gotta da da da. Um, and to have an outlay on medication to be so dependent on it uh, for survival is it's not something I feel is a good thing for me to have to worry about um, so yeah basically that's why I decided two months ago I think it was two months ago I decided I was gonna s cut down on taking my antidepressants um, rather than going to the doctors and talking it through with them um, I felt confident enough that I could Mm, evaluate and cut down on the medication myself. Um, 
So basically, I was taking a thing called. I don't know how you say it. Sertraline. Um, now, a month ago, uh, no, two months ago, I was on, say, a one. 100 gram tablet plus a 50 gram tablet every day so that's 150 grams um, that is uh, very costly to be on and um, now while I'm in my own country I got help from the the um, I would say the HSE uh, which is the Irish um, medical uh, board um, so whilst I was able to be on them comfortably and then to not financially impact me I if I were to ever move abroad or ever have to pay for these myself I thought it would be it was a huge rather than being a crutch anymore to helping me I thought it would I'd consider it a drain and a kind of ball and chain something I'd struggle to be able to afford so I said I kind of wanted to be free of these so I s initially I started just taking the 100 gram tablet every day so I dropped it by 50 so I was taking a 100 gram tablet instead of 150 grams so I did that for 30 days then after 30 days of cutting down to 100 grams with no real side effects that I noticed, um, nothing major, uh, after that month I decided, okay, I can go lower again. So I went down to 50. Now, for the past month I've taken 50 grams. for 50 grams daily um, I no longer it's been a month since I started taking 50 dose um, I did say that I was going to after this month I was going to cut down to come off them completely but I think to be a little cautious I'm going to start taking 25 grams a day for the next month and then I'm going to ultimately come off them and hopefully that will be, be me finished with antidepressants. Um, I, think, I think it's something I may be able to do and I I I wouldn't be doing it if I didn't think it was possible and if it was the right thing to do for me. I think I've gained everything I can so far out of antidepressants and I think now it was time to cut down and move on um, part ways with antidepressants. Um, now, obviously you should go and talk to your doctor before you cut down or to stop taking antidepressants. But I just felt I know myself more than anyone <laughs> can ever know me. So I just said, I think I can do it. Because um, instead of a 15 minute appointment that turns into a five minute appointment with a doctor, I spend every day with me. Um, I know myself. Um, so. I'm the perfect uh, nurse or doctor to to look after me whilst I'm going off depress uh, anti-depression tablets. Um, so, I don't know, I think I'll be quite proud when I walk in and I make an appointment with my doctor in maybe another month. And I'll walk in and they'll be like, oh, you're here for uh, another, um, what's the word? when you get a prescription, a prescription, another six months prescription. Um, I'll go, no, actually, um, 
I'm, I'm, I'm off antidepressants now, I'm not taking them anymore, so uh, here's how I did it, and this is what I found, and hopefully we won't be seeing so much of each other anymore. Um, so, yeah, so I've got, that's basically why I've decided to cut down on antidepressants with the, with the, the intentions of cutting out of my cutting them out of my life completely and um, because I think it's time to stand on my own two feet and they're a crutch that I don't really need anymore and they they're, they're kind of not they're not helping me anymore so it's kind of like having two perfectly working legs and carrying a crutch for absolutely no reason um, while crutches serve brilliant purposes for people that need them and um, if you don't need them they're kind of a hindrance <laughs> um, so yeah I'll keep you posted I'll update in another month and um, to let you know how I got on okay good luck